Hi there, Rhys Tuscana here from fireplaceproducts.co.uk here today with another in-depth uh, product report on the uh, Stovax Brunel 2CB. Uh, Brunel 2CB is the, is, uh, the middle of the range. Uh, there's three stoves in the Brunel range. You've got the 1A, the 2CB and the 3CB. Uh, the model that we have here is in the ivory enamel. We have the ivory swatch there. Um, it is also available in the laurel green and also in the midnight blue enamel too. Uh, if you don't want the enamel finish, you can also have it in the standard matte black finish as well. Uh, with this stove, now you've got the uh, door opening on the left hand side. Now you do get a little tool with that, so you can use the tool to open the door. However, it is a little bit fiddly, uh, so we'd generally say that although you have got the tool, it's probably always worth using a glove uh, when opening the door of the stove. Uh, inside the stove, we've got a vermiculite lined firebox with a cast iron grate and cast iron log retaining bar here. At the top, we've got the uh, air control, so that's your primary air control at the top here. Uh, all the way to the right is fully open, all the way to the left is fully closed, and that allows air in through this slot at the top, comes down here, and then when the door is shut, passes that air down the glass and that feeds back into the firebox. Also at the top we've got the tertiary air supply, all these holes inside this stainless steel baffle. Uh, now that is pulling air from underneath here, where we have the tertiary air supply. We push that in, that closes it down, pull it out, opens it up and that injects air right in the top of the firebox. Uh, lastly then we've got the secondary control there, which is pulling air in from underneath the grate and that comes up when the fuel is burning. Now one thing to note with this stove, uh, all of these screws that we have on the top here going all the way around, uh, you need to undo all of those so you've got access to the flue. So I uh, strongly suggest when you're purchasing this stove, always buy a piece of flue pipe with a door in it, because uh, otherwise it will be a fitter as, and a chimney sweep's nightmare uh, if they have to actually try and sweep the stove from inside, uh, inside the stove. So always go for the door. Uh, the ash pan, now a good little safety feature with these to stop the stove from over firing, when you shut this door, you can't open this door too far, so it only open a jar. That allows a little bit of air in, but not a great deal, so you can't actually overfire this deliberately. There's a bit of design uh, bolts there when they were doing it. So you have to open the main door, and then you can open this door. See this little notch here? That is the reason why you can open that door. Uh, inside there, then we've got the ash pan. So in the ash pan, it's quite a large ash pan inside, it catches all the ash from the falling uh, embers from the main firebox there. Uh, you also have this nice ash lip at the bottom there, so when you're emptying and cleaning up the stove, any ash, it falls onto the lip rather than onto your hearth. Uh, the Brunel 2CB you're looking at is a six kilowatt output stove and an efficiency of about 79%. Flue outlet is a five inch spigot and is available on the, either the top or the rear of the stove. Uh, last thing really to say, I'm gonna shut these doors down is that you have on this side here uh, is the riddling arm so for inside the stove pull this bar again can use the tool that's supplied but it is a bit fiddly and that will riddle your grate and allowing all those embers to fall down i've been rich toscani of fireplaceproducts.co.uk thanks for watching another in-depth product review and uh, if you'd like to find out more information about all our products you can always subscribe to our channel here